Oh, what the hell is that? What the hell? Oh my God. I think something ate it. What's up everyone? This is Ken Tanak of Wish for Fish, giving you tips, bringing you on adventures, and taking you to the water. I just got back from Bolivia with untamed angling at Samane Lodge. Let me tell you something, this set the bar for destination fly fishing. Uh, the experience is amazing, the accommodations are amazing, and needless to say, the fishing is amazing. Everything from the people, to the food, to the guide, to the lodge, to the transportation was top notch. I was down there with Chimane Lodge at the Secure location, and let me tell you, the experience is unbelievable. Being in the jungle, uh, in the middle of nowhere Bolivia, and fishing to the most incredible fish, it's just something that you have to experience yourself. I could do an entire video on just the Chimane people, the natives there are just unbelievable. Unbelievable. They're so fascinating. So my native Chimane guides were the true heroes here and without them I wouldn't have been able to catch half the fish. They were able to see fish from hundreds of yards away and tell you exactly what it was. It was unreal. So big shout out to Placido, Jesus, Paulino, and Jorge. Without them I wouldn't have been able to catch half the fish I caught. And speaking of the number of fish, I couldn't even put all the fish in this video because the video would have been probably an hour. I think a big part of destination fly fishing is also being with people that you don't know and meeting like-minded people and I was lucky enough to be with Terry and Rose and with or without catching fish I would come home with that trip with the gift of having friends for life. I had a great time on and off the water with my guides Juan Manuel and Santiago and it was nothing but laughs which I think makes the trip. I even made a bet with Santiago that if I didn't catch a Paku I would shave my head like Mario Baracus and the weird thing is that I did catch one, so I was so excited and I wanted to catch another one that I made another bet that if I did catch one, I would shave my head like Mario Baracus. And you'll see what that's all about. And for some reason in Argentina, Mario Baracus, which I'm guessing is from B.A. Baracus, is Mr. T. So down there, the three main species are the Dorado, the Paku, and the Yatarana. And if you catch all three in one day, it's considered the Bolivian Slam. And I was lucky enough to be the first person this season to achieve that. And I was just a little bit excited about it. As you'll see from the video, the Dorado is one beast of a fish, but the Paku was the strongest freshwater fish that I've ever hooked on a fly. And the guides tell me that the Yatarana, pound for pound, is even stronger than that. Uh, unfortunately, I wasn't able to catch one of those 15 pound Yatarana but I couldn't even imagine if that's the case. If you're wondering what equipment I used, the list of all my equipment is always listed below in the description box. So hope you enjoy this video of me in Bolivia with Chimane Lodge, and I'll see you on the water. All right, so I just got to Camino Real. Uh, I gotta be quiet because it's like 11.30, but I'm gonna go and see what the room's all about before I go to the jungle tomorrow, baby. This place is amazing, by the way. So this is where I'm staying for the evening. I'm gonna get a little rest. It's off to the jungle, baby. Oh yeah. All right, so it's breakfast time. I came down to the hotel uh, restaurant and let me tell you something, uh, this place, nice. This is what I call breakfast right here. They're gonna come pick us up at 7 a.m. and then we take a little smaller plane a couple hours away uh, to secure lodge and then you know what time it is. It's fishing. So this is straight up amazing. This is where I'm gonna be staying for the week. Uh, I feel like straight out of a movie. Like crazy, crazy awesome. So it looks like each one of us has our own little uh, quarters. Let's go check out what's inside. I haven't even seen what's inside yet, so. Ooh, nice. Okay, bathroom here, wow. Whoa. 
love it. Yeah. Your it's not like he's gonna run into anything. <laughs> oh, exactly. Yeah. It's up the other plane. It's yeah. really cool. So you, know. Hey, so you know that I'm all about the food, and this is off to a fantastic start so far. Kiss it, yo. That looks amazing. So, today's our first official day. It's 6 o'clock in the morning, uh, but it's coffee time. Luckily, I was able to get out a little bit on my own uh, on the water, and I landed my first Dorado. It was a juvenile Dorado, but hey, Dorado nonetheless, so. I'm hopefully gonna hook into its older brother, or hopefully it's uh, maybe great-grandfather is what I'm looking for. So the local Samanes, they make all this stuff, and they're selling it, and uh, you better believe the first thing I did was grab my good luck necklace. Hopefully it brings me good luck. This Jaguar's tooth. Easy for you. It's the same. It's the same. Okay, then I'm gonna take this one. Okay. Breakfast? Yeah, and breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's time to get on the water. Oh yeah. Today's the first day on the water. We're going about 20 minutes downstream to the first beat, and hopefully, there's gonna be some fish there. Oh, what the hell is that? What the hell? Oh my god. I think something ate it. Oh my god. What? It's not the fish in Dorado eating oh. fish. Yeah, no. Oh my god. What the hell was that? What the hell? That was insane. I know, but. Oh my god. Jesus. There was nothing I could do. I couldn't stop him. Yeah. Oh my god. That other one was crazy. It was crazy. Cheers it up. Ooh. All I gotta say is excellent day of fishing and I top it off with excellent food. I told these people I could go home tomorrow and I would be completely satisfied. But I have the rest of the week. Okay, to top off a fantastic day and a fantastic dinner is fantastic dessert. This is passion fruit cheesecake. It looks amazing. You see the water going over the log? Yeah. Well, there is a fish. Basic, is basically, a, right above, above the log under the water. I'm gonna get right here then. Yeah, what? Well, like smoke, right? Yeah, yeah. Now, I've mentioned this tip before, uh, always check your line when you're dealing with a bigger fish. Uh, you could get jammed up really quickly. And you could see my guide Santiago goes out and tries to scare the other Dorado trying to eat my fly out of the mouth of the Dorado. And that happened quite a bit. Oh, that's a big one. Oh. No! Oh! 
Set, 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 set. Let it go, let it go, let it go. I... You see? Yeah. Strong artist. Holy <laughs> Yeah. So, I just got completely schooled by a Paku. We just ran into a Paku party. And, uh... Set the hook and... Look at that. Just broke the hook. Unreal. Oh my god! That was a big one. Now you can see after my cast, I throw two quick mins, and that's to get my fly down a little deeper. So if you're a streamer fishing and looking to get your streamer down in a little deeper water, I highly recommend doing that. Oh! Yes! Yeah. I saw him take it. It was awesome. <sighs> yep. Nice. Thank you, Placido. That was a hard strike, man. Yeah. Yes. What? Another one? Ooh, this is, this is my biggest one. <sighs> Ooh! <laughs> oh my God. This one is, uh, this one is strong. Yes! It's what? Five fish. Five? Hold on. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, that's the same two, though. Between them, between them, right? There's another one. Oh, oh, back, back. Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go. Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go. Let it go, let it go, yeah, let it go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got it. Boom. Yeah. Mm hmm I tightened it a little bit. <laughs> Come on! Please don't come unbuttoned. Ooh, ooh. Look at there's so many Paku in here. Look at the other one. Yeah, so many, two, three. Oh, get out of that rocks. Like the rocks, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should I try to land this thing? Yeah, try to, start to walk back. Okay. Right here. Right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grab that sucker. Yes. Yeah! Yeah! 
You I tried mean, it, right? Yeah, okay. I know. <laughs> I love how you're so worried about me. You gotta love hanging out with uh, a bunch of Argentines because it's latte time. Very famous. <laughs> Your next girlfriend. This duck is amazing. Come on. Yeah, I know. It turned out pretty good. I get a closer, right? Oh, it's a good one. Yes. Yes. It's time to take a little break. Just a little stream side lunch. Where, 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 where? Awesome! Nice palacio! Fish on, fish on. Uh, oh, it's a big one. Another big one. Oh. Another big one. Try to fight it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, he broke it off. No, they feed it. What? No, the other one. Big. I tried to cast. You have luck. Another one attacked my fly while it was in its mouth. Today's been so unreal. This is what the fly looks like after several of those monsters. This is what it looks like. <laughs> you know it's a good day when your fly looks like this. You see the fish? Yeah. Another one here. Look. Where? Start with this first. Between those rocks, those rocks is the little... Those little rocks. Off. Which rocks? Okay. Look. It's there. Yeah, it's I there. see him. There. I'm going to land it right here. Yeah. Quick, quick. Got it, got it. Ah. Oh. Oh. Terry's big boy. Ooh. Yeah. 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 The biggest golden dorado I've ever yeah. caught. Yes. Drag's good, see? It's good, it's good. 
Mario, Mario. Should I try to beach him? Nope. Hi, okay. If you're wondering how the first Paku broke my hook, check out these human teeth and the crushing power to eat nuts. So you could see Santiago pointing at the fish. Oh. He didn't want to make any sudden movements considering we were all standing there on the bank. After a couple casts, I knew he was going to take my fly. And on the last cast, I couldn't even strip it in anymore, so... All I could do was raise my rod tip a little bit, and that was enough for him to take my fly. Side casting Dorado! Let me guess what you're gonna say in between the f log and the. <laughs> No. Is it? Is it? Grand Slam! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> well, you better bring it in the boat. I'm gonna take a oh, picture God. of that. Yeah! yeah! Oh! Oh! Yeah, bomba. Oh, Jesus! No, no, I, I got it, I got it. He's finally done. <laughs> okay. I'm just, I'm just gonna get out. When you shoot the line, a lot of people like to let go. Uh, it's best not to, uh, so then you could immediately start stripping. Oh. I've had many oh. takes right when the fly hits the water. When you feel something, you strip fast, 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 fast. I got it. Oh! oh that's not, that is a nice one. I... Go ahead, just do it. Just Come do it. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Make it easy. Oh my god. Tomorrow we'll put gel on it. Is it even? Your reputation. Oh, even? Are you oh, kidding? Oh my god, it's so even. Oh. Oh, it's horrible. Totally. Horrible. Easy. What is no, this? Problem. Yeah. It's a. No, oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's a sea. You know? It's like a seal. Sea. Like a lightning. Come on. Much better. Yeah? Yeah, mejor. What's up everyone? Thank you very much for watching. 
If you like what you saw, please do like, share, or comment below. Take a look at the Wish for Fish website at wishforfish.com to keep up to date with what's going on with Wish for Fish, as well as get some killer discounts, and take a look at some of our upcoming hosted trips. Don't forget to take a look at the Wish for Fish store for some sweet merchandise. If you're on Facebook or Instagram or other forms of social media, give us a follow at Wish for Fish. And most importantly, if you haven't subscribed already, please do because we're constantly updating new footage all the time. So you can do so by clicking this right here. And if you're interested in seeing more, take a look at some of our other videos from this season's playlist. Thanks everyone, and I'll see you on the next.